Hi, Cindy. Um, would you be able to tell me how I can stop some particular thoughts that are coming to my mind, the thoughts that I don't like? Ah, you want to be able to control your thoughts. Yeah. And be the police woman of your thoughts. <laughs> Not this one, that one, okay, yeah, you go ahead. No, you stop. <laughs> it's okay, most people want to do that. Why do you want to do that? Well, sometimes I notice that some thoughts are make me feel bad. Mm. So I don't want to think about that. Okay. And, um, yeah. What is the solution? <laughs> <laughs> so thoughts don't make us feel bad. Just because you have a thought doesn't mean you have to feel bad. It's putting your power of attention into a thought which grows the feeling. It's like plugging it in. So thoughts actually are not a problem. They're harmless. They will come and go on their own if left alone. But if not left alone, and you put your power of attention into it, they will, in effect, come to life in your experience. It's the brain's job to offer you up thoughts. That's what it does, and it does a brilliant job of it. It puts out about 40,000 thoughts a day. But you're not aware of them all. You don't put your attention on them all. You don't believe them all. But there's a few that you choose to believe are true. And when you do that and you put your power of attention on it, then they come to life in your experience. But thoughts are options. They're not mandatory in that you don't have to choose them. If you don't touch them, if you let them be, they'll come and go harmlessly. But I think, I was thinking that our life is controlled by the thoughts. Like, whatever thoughts you choose, that's how your day is going on. Whatever. Or uh, the action that you're choosing. It's depending on the thoughts that you are putting attention on. Is, in a, is, in, is that right? Mm -hmm. Thoughts in and of themselves can't control anything. They're just options. So they arise as options. And there are some that you're most interested in because you believe them to be true. So then you put your power of attention on them, you focus on them, you eliminate all other possibilities, and you build a bad state based on them, and then you find yourself acting based on that bad state. Now you don't have to act based on the bad state. You could be feeling bad and feeling like you want to yell at somebody, but you don't yell at them, right? So you have choice of not acting on a bad state. You have that gap of freedom always available to you. It's mm -hmm. enough now to know yeah. that thoughts are options, that you don't have to believe them. You don't have to put your power of attention on them. Okay. Mm -hmm. Isn't that good news? Yeah, that's very good news. So there is something that is not clear for me here about the thoughts. Okay. Yeah. It's in the way it, I, I see that thoughts are not a problem, but I see that thoughts are kind of putting attention on the thoughts make you to make a decision what to do next moment. Mm. That's a different thing. You think that you're making a decision on the putting attention on the thoughts, putting attention on different thoughts. So... I don't know if I'm could right. We, could, we, <laughs> could we say that you decided to come here today? Could, uh, could we say that? Yeah. That you decided, you think yeah. you decided to come here today? Yeah, I think I decided. What made this happen today? Was it the fact that it, you got an invitation? Yeah. Really? What about the fact your car didn't have a problem? That's true. There wasn't a snowstorm. Yeah, that's right. You were no, healthy enough. My desire, enough. my desire, actually. The desire. You were healthy enough. Yeah. If one of these things was out of place, there was no accident on the way here. OK? 
Okay, a lot of things made this moment happen. Not one person thinking they've made a decision to be here. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> I love that answer, actually. Because it doesn't go that deep. Yes. When yeah. Yeah. we think about that. Nothing in this universe happens without the whole universe making it so. Yeah. <laughs> I see that. Thank you so much for... So, uh, you don't, you're not deciding anything. You yeah. don't have to decide anything that takes the weight of the universe off your shoulders. <laughs> and mm. the decision will become known to you after it's been decided. Mm -hmm. Then you're made aware of it. <laughs> <laughs> Great. I really okay. like that. <laughs> okay.